Hi guys, this video is about an issue that some of us experience when we try to import a MIDI file to our Logic Pro session. If we open a Logic session directly from a MIDI file, this session will have the MIDI regions in the correct places, see in this case starting on bar 2, and we will bring all the markers, time signature information, tempo map, etc. But if you need to work from a template or an existing session, and some of us have to because we might need more complex templates to work with, the MIDI import will often come in with the wrong information. In this example, you see the MIDI region is coming on bar one and all the markers here are missing. To solve this problem, we first open the MIDI file as its own logic session and we save it in a temporary location. Then we open our template and instead of importing the MIDI file, as we would do normally with Command-I, we open this browser in the upper corner here, or hit the letter F, and you click on the All Files tab. In here, we look for the logic session generated by the MIDI that we just saved earlier, and we double click on it. And in the center here, there's a column named Content, and you want to check the boxes near the global type tracks, the markers, signature, tempo, and the MIDI instruments too. Finally, you click Replace on the bottom of that window that you can close by hitting the F key again. And now you see that this time the MIDI region was imported on the correct place. And we now have all the markers and tempo information as well.